See you, Scott. You too. Uh, so you wrote your album, Hotel de Ville, when you were living in a little apartment in Montreal yes. on the Avenue Hotel de Ville. What was it about that city that helped get the creative juices flowing? Well, I feel like a lot of the, the record was like, I felt like I had unfinished business um, to take care of. And uh, well, there's a lot of reasons why, but um, you know, when I got signed to a record label, I was 15, and by the time I left high school, I was like trying to write a record, and and I did, and it did did well enough for me to you know travel the world and see all different places and tour, and it was amazing, and it was like it was weird because when I wrote that first record, I think I was in a pretty tough spot in my life, and I think um, you know the whole thing of like I'm gonna write a record was like I'm gonna get out of here, and I did, and I like got to travel the world, but. The thing about that is like when you're on tour, you're traveling and you're making music, you don't really have like, it's not the space to, to make things better. Like it's just, there's so much experiences that you can't really like fix things. When I got back from that experience, you know, it was about three years, um, I wanted to go somewhere to like really just, just chill out and, and uh, figure stuff out. And Montreal was the first option because like I said, right after, after high school I was making music, but all my friends went to university and they all went to McGill or Concordia or, or what, whatever. And um, so it was weird. It was like... It was like the musician's equivalent of going to university? Yeah. <laughs> And so here we are at the um, Festival d'Été de Québec. This thing's huge. Yeah. I did not know how big it was mm -hmm. until you know, I was doing the lead up research for this thing. It's, it's amazing. Mm -hmm. I mean, we saw a concert yesterday with 80,000 people for the weekend, the, the weekend show. The lineup of, like, as, as a music fan, you must be excited to be here. Oh, yeah, I mean, from like Shawn Mendes to The Weeknd to Neil Young, I just like walked by. I mean, he wasn't on stage, but his crew, even just his crew <laughs> sound checking the piano, I was like, <gasps> so like that's that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I mean, it's an honor. And like, that's another weird part of this is like, you know, I think we all make music that we love and we care about as individuals. And then to like be nominated for a Juno or to be at a festival with like, and you're like, but. I'm not as good as that guy, you know? It's like weird. Like, I don't think any of us really, I mean, probably some, but I think a, like a musician, like, trait is to just sort of be self deprecating. And I'm always like, wait, I'm on the same bill as The yeah. Weeknd? But I'm just a small man in patterned pants. <laughs> I hear you on the radio, or whether I hear you live, whether it's acoustic or the band, like you have a great, a, a fantastic voice. Um, and I, I, and I'm, I'm always so impressed when I when I when I hear him. I hear someone live, like, wow, I wonder if they're going to sound as good as they do on the radio. It's always nice to hear it, and you're one of those people. But it was also really nice to hear that you credit your band for a lot of your uh, for a lot of your sound, and, and that you when you write music, you write it. With the, is that right? You write it with them yeah, in mind? Yeah, well that was the luxury of making, like my first record was an EP, and my second record was a full length album, and the, the luxury of that is like, I had, by the time I wrote Hotel de Ville, which was my, my, my full length, it was like, I had a band, I had like fans, I knew kind of way more what I was, and so when I was going to write a record, it was like, well, I'm going to play this record live, and so, like, I didn't want to just hire the best musicians in Toronto, not to say that my band isn't the best musicians in Toronto or the world, but, you know, I didn't want to just, like, hire, hire guns. I really wanted, like, my band to be there, so I wrote all the songs with, you know, co-wrote some of them, like, per, like had a producer. We made demos, and then when we went into the studio to, like, finish up the, the record, I, like, brought my whole band in and was like, that guitar part, play something better, and it was, it was cool because it was, like, if we're gonna be on stage playing this, like I want us to share this record, so I definitely feel like we do, and it, it's cool to like, instead of being on stage, like just playing something I wrote in my bedroom to be able to be like, but you help me write that, <laughs> so. Uh, Scott, we're gonna let you go here. Thank you so much. Cool, Have Thanks. a great show. Thanks. Enjoy the festival, enjoy your summer. We'll see you soon. I will, bye.